Sediments and other materials are deposited on the Earth's surface in layers. Archaeologists study these layers, or strata, to understand how sites formed and to determine the relative ages of the artifacts in the layers. This study is called stratigraphy. Archaeologists interpret strata according to the law of superposition. This law states that the layers deposited first are the oldest and will be found at the bottom of a site, while the layers deposited most recently are the youngest and will be found at the top. Consider these three books. If I stack them one at a time, the book I set down first ends up on the bottom, the book I set down second ends up in the middle, and the book I set down last ends up on top. Now pretend each of these books represents a layer at an archaeological site. The materials found in the bottom layer were deposited first, and the materials found in the top layer were deposited last. The first visitors to the Hardaway site probably left trash and other evidence behind, like these projectile points. As natural and human-made debris accumulated over thousands of years, it eventually covered the traces of these first peoples. Other groups visited the Hardaway site, made new stone tools, and left their old ones behind. More debris over time eventually covered these artifacts and helped to preserve them. When archaeologists excavated the Hardaway site, they found four distinct layers. They interpreted the artifacts in the uppermost layer as the youngest and the artifacts in the bottom layer as the oldest. Today, archaeologists are still studying these artifacts to understand what people did at Hardaway at different times in the past.